guys. Um, yeah, so I went for another uh, run with the bicycle that I have that I just got and this camera. So uh, yeah, I'm looking up there, but I know I'm supposed to look over here, but I'm not. I'm not used to that just yet. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna <laughs> let it slide for this one, anyways. I'm gonna answer some more questions. Um, and there's like some footage uh, that was taken with my new camera there. I'm still kind of learning how to do it all and uh, Yeah, I'm gonna be a little bit late on putting out the cover for this week Just because I, I was like doing a lot just trying to learn the, the usage of this camera and editing a lot of the videos um, Because we're doing another collaboration for this week, so it might be out tomorrow and uh, let's get back into the questions Here we go Right here. Now, I can use the phone and look at the things, which is pretty cool as well. Um, going back to the favorite movies things uh, video um, and the questions there, I think there's two left here. So, would you ever consider doing a switch up of some other buskers covering your originals and vice versa? Uh, HH in. I would definitely do that, that's a great idea. Um, comment below or, yeah, comment below if, if you've um, want me to cover a song from the other buskers and let me know which busker and what song because that'd be pretty cool and who would you like to hear uh, covering my songs um, Emma Farmer Casey happy belated birthday beautiful camera yeah it's all over there already to see what I captured and can create so far um, I think I've been through these questions before that's okay I'm gonna go to the other video here and see does this make me a vlogger now? <laughs> it's been it's been quite a wild ride actually trying to learn all these uh, new technologies and stuff like that. But like we have time for it now, which is pretty cool. Um, yes, you are a vlogger now. Quite a difference. Who's here said this? Congratulations on one love collaboration video. That video was amazing, wasn't it? Oh my god, such hard work put into it. And uh, yeah, not not liking the nail color, Bob Green. A little bit of blue. Uh, I don't know. I, I don't think blue would suit me. I think black is the only color for me. <laughs> black everything today. Um, when is your cover up on Spotify? Somewhere only we know. Uh, I think that should be coming in the next few months or something like that. I'm, I'm working on a new cover CD, so that will be out pretty soon. Lydia Theron says, love your nails. Thank you very much. Jovivora, jo, Jovirora MA. Kukuk semenor. I don't know what you're trying to say there. Oh, when when did I start using these earrings? Uh, funny story, actually, when I was in high school, I was a bit of a, a bad arse myself here. So I had like a, a normal earring here and it, it kind of got lost. So I decided to like, you know, make like a nail really, really hot until it was like red hot. So it's like all the bacteria was gone. And then I just stuck it in, but then it was a bit too big for that um, pierced uh, ear. So it kind of stretched it out a bit, and then I realized that you can actually stretch your ears and put gauges in it. And so, like, I was 19, I decided to put, like, another one here and make, like, a smaller one. And then I was like, you know what? Let's make them equal. So, uh, yeah. But this one was actually made the right way with, like, the actual cone or whatever method there was to kind of make it bigger but this one was a bit of a funny story um, it's a bit messed up to be fair I, I wouldn't recommend it uh, to do it that way anyways very unhygienic as well I think in a way um, from a bumpkin to a city dweller is help being in lockdown with a few people around um, get on your nerves well like to be honest I think a lot of people are kind of stuck with people that they don't want to be stuck with which is kind of, sh you know, crap. Um, and, you know, like a lot of things, you know, like if you're around people, like the same people too much, they kind of get on your nerves. I mean, people are all very different and stuff like that. But like so far, I'm pretty blessed with my, my flatmates who are pretty cool guys. And um, yeah, they're all into music as well. So they're kind of like pretty chill about me playing music also inside the room and being loud and stuff. Um, it's coming to five minutes, this things over here. That was Alison Lane. Um, just leave a comment so I can brag about you, Jacob, before he, wa he wasn't famous. Yeah, <laughs> surpass Ed Sheeran. I don't know about that. David Sirkovich, 
Maybe one day, hopefully. Cross fingers. Have you ever been to Germany before? I have been to Köln and I've been to Berlin. Um, so yeah, that's pretty cool as well. Even when it's really cold at 5.30 in the morning. Yeah. It's it's sometimes, I don't like getting up super early and when it's like really cold and stuff like that. Um, I used to have to go to work in Holland in like a, a tomato farm where I had to go at like half five in the morning and it was like snowing, raining, whatever, but you had to go with a bicycle and it was like around half an hour bike ride outside the city and stuff. And I didn't really enjoy that very much, to be honest. Um, I like it when it's like just weather, like home. Like today, it's just very sunny, you know? Love that. What chords do you use for summer only? We know Fallen King. Uh, super easy. I think it's C, E minor, A minor, uh, F, G. There's a few, <laughs> there's a few anyways there. I can show you later if you can DM me there, uh, Fallen King. Awesome. So uh, I think that's all the time we have for today. The views are so pretty. Thank you so much, Connie. And Dom's life. Yes. All right, guys. If you guys want to have any more questions, please comment in the comment section below. And if you guys aren't subscribed and like this video yet, please do. That would be super amazing. Slap that like button, right? Um, and yeah, I'll see you on the next one. So yeah, looking forward to more questions. Awesome. Ciao.